So today we are doing a unicorn makeup tutorial as you probably saw in the title and this is kind of just the look I wore for Halloween even though it's so late in November. Huh? I just kind of liked how purpley and pretty and highlighted it was so I'm just going to show you guys how I did it anyways. Um, but yeah I'm just starting off with moisturizing and priming my face and then we're going to get started. Alright, so I'm going in with my L'Oreal Lumi Cushion Foundation, and then I will be going in with my Collection Lasting Perfection Concealer and Maybelline's Fit Me Concealer in the shade Light and Warm Medium, I think? I don't know. For powder, I will be using Maybelline's Fit Me Matte and Poreless Pressed Powder. And then I'm going in with my trusty old Soap and Glory Brow Archery Pencil. And for this look, we're going to have some pretty strong brows to start off with because there's going to be a lot of like highlighting and stuff and we want to make sure that our brows can still frame our face. Then I'm going in with Benefit's Gimme Brow to really just set everything in place. To prime the eyes, I will be using Max Pro Longwear Paint Pot in the shade Painterly. Then for our eyeshadow base, I'm going to use a MAC Pigment in the shade Naked. Now for a lot of the eyeshadows in this look, I will be using my Too Faced Chocolate Bar Palette. Um, I really love it. It just blends so nicely and it's so pigmented and it smells so nice. And um, yeah, so I'm using Salted Caramel to create that transition within my lid. And then I will go in with White Chocolate and kind of pack this all over my lid to get ready for the stronger pigment colors later. Um, I'm going to go in with Max Red Brick to make it more orange and more poppy. And in this part, I used another MAC shade. Um, it's a purple one. I think it's Parfait Amour. Um, it didn't really have much pigment, and I was really confused, so I'm going to go in with my MAC Crushed Metallic Pigment instead. And this works so much better. It's very glittery. I will say there's a lot of fallout, though, so you might want to be careful with that. Um, I'm then going to go in with a uh, Candied Violet from the Too, pa Too Faced palette to darken the crease a little. And then I'm going to go in with Black Forest Truffle and really define this crease. Um, I tried to make it a cut crease kind of look and then I decided not to so I kind of just blended everything out. Yeah, I realized I'm like really bad at trying to make a cut crease look, but you know, it's kind of there just a little more blended. Oh well. Um, I'm gonna go in with Champagne Truffle in the inner corners of my eyes, making everything pop. And then for eyeliner, I'm going to be using Max Pro Longwear Fluid Line um, in the shade Black Track. And then I'm gonna take a little more of Candy Violet and run this under my eyes. And for the fun part of this look, um, I kind of just put these little like gems, um, rhinestones, rhinestones is the word I'm looking for, and I just used some eyelash glue and glued them to my face. And then I went in to curl my lashes, in which I realized I probably should have curled my lashes before applying gems. Nice job. Um, then I'm going to use my Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara, it's waterproof, love it, yeah. 
for blush, I'm going to be using this one from Chanel. Um, it's in the shade Reflex, and it's just like a really nice, pretty glow. Uh, for bronzer, I will be using NYC's Sun and Bronze. I'm just all bronzing up the face. And for the first part of highlighter, I am going in with Too Faced's Candlelight Glow Highlighter in Rosy Gold. Just popping this on my cheekbones. And I'm also going to use the same highlighter to highlight my brow bone. This is the part where I messed up. Like, seriously messed up. I don't know what I was thinking. Um, but basically I took like this another one of the crushed um, metallic pigment things and it's way too dark of a shade I realized that really quickly so I tried to fix it and go over it with um, a different shade it's um, as white as snow I believe and yep trying to fix my mistakes by blending <laughs> Because I don't have enough glitter on my face, I'm going to be adding NYX's Glitter Mania in the shade Crystal. And then I'm also going to be attempting to snatch the nose. Yeah. And to brighten up my corners a little more, I'm going to take this white um, Urban Decay eyeliner. It's in the shade Yayo, I think is how you pronounce it. Yeah. And then I'm going to go in with my MAC lipstick in. Uh, Viva Gaga 2, Glam 2, I don't know. And then Rimmel's Stay Glossy. I think it's in the shade Blushing, but I can't really tell because it doesn't have the label of color on it. And this is the final look. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video even remotely. Um, I'll see you whenever I post my next video. Okay, bye!